Welcome back! As you can see, we are separating the test in a different lecture. That's because we want to encourage you to do it on your own as homework. If you want to try that, please pause the video, download the file associated with the lesson, and go for it. Or you can skip it for now and proceed with the lecture. To test the model, we use the method evaluate. Let's declare two variables, test loss and test accuracy, equal to model evaluate of the test inputs and test targets. And that's about it. Recall that evaluate returns the loss and any other metrics we've requested in our model outline. In our case, that was the accuracy. To make the result pretty, we can print them with some nice formatting. Good. That's the final accuracy of the model. Naturally, it is close to the validation accuracy, as we did not fiddle too much with hyperparameters. Note that sometimes you can get a test accuracy higher than the validation one. That's nothing but pure luck. Theoretically, the test accuracy should be lower or equal to the validation one. Okay, from this point on, I am no longer allowed to change the model. I'll follow this simple machine learning rule and let you do the hard work. Phew! So, there are several exercises waiting for you. Please, jump ahead and give them a go. Good luck, and thanks for watching!